Well, my story begins about 20 years ago when we moved to Japan, well, 20, about 20 years ago, I guess. We moved to Japan and I was exercising every day. I was feeling great and we went skiing and I fell and I hit my head and my tailbone and I, I, I blanked out for a few, sec few minutes and, um, and I didn't think I was seriously hurt. And so after about three or four months, I started noticing my body changing. Something was happening and I didn't know what it was. And so we moved back to the, we went, moved from Japan to Canada. And when we got to Canada, I fell again off the ladder. And that's when it, everything just started changing immediately. And I was, was in so much pain at that time. And then we moved down here to Panama City. I kind of, it kind of got sort of under control. It wasn't too bad, but then we had to go to, had to go to um, Greece, and it went in full blown pain, chronic pain, all throughout my body. And the muscles were tight. There was knots all over my body. The connective tissue was tightening up, and I couldn't control it. And um, we were there for two years, and that was the longest two years I'd ever spent someplace. And so we got orders back to the States when we got to Colorado Springs. All the my past the tre treatments I had, I had military doctors trying to help me, and instead of helping me, they just made it worse because when we were in Greece, I saw military doctors in Germany, and the medication they gave me, it just put it in overdrive, that pain in overdrive, it went from a 10 to a 20, the pain did. And I gained so much weight also during that time. And I, plus I was exercising also, and it was just, everything just felt like it was just getting worse and worse and worse. And so get to Colorado Springs, I saw a rheumatologist and he thought I was crazy. Cause you know, I was telling him, you know, everything. And I was ready to kill myself is basically what it was. When I found somebody, a good massage therapist and then I, the chiropractor I was seeing, he retired and this other man, he came in and I didn't, wasn't for sure if I was going to like him or not. He was blind and he's the one started my recovery back and so he was making adjustments that nobody else had ever done and I was getting where I was feeling better with that. And then I was doing other things too, along with the massage therapy and um, the chiropractic. I was also doing dry needling out there and everything was working together. So when we left Colorado Springs, I knew who I needed to see and what kind of person I needed to see. And matter of fact, a year or two before we moved back, I was looking anyway and I found Dr. Salome and I knew that's where I needed to go because he was doing the same thing or even more than what Dr. Rocco was doing in Colorado Springs and I needed to stay on that path and when when I left Colorado Springs I was in no pain whatsoever well I was in a little pain <laughs> and then we got we moved to Tallahassee and then the pain started coming back and I knew at that time I needed to get this under control because I knew where it was going. And we finally moved back here to Panama City and I knew exactly who I needed to see to get my pain back because it's the deep, deep part of the body that needed an adjustment in my neck and my body that nobody else was doing. Well, I needed a doctor that was going to do the cranial adjustments, the head adjustments, the sacrum, the, the whole body, the deep parts of my spine and stuff. And matter of fact, Dr. Salome does more, did more than Dr. Rocco did, I think, because he did adjust, he's doing adjustments that I wasn't even aware of. <laughs> and I was just wanting my body back and I wanted to get where I was, can get off my medications. That's what I wanted to do, the strong medications I was on. And then when I started the nutrition too, and he started testing me, with all this other stuff, it all makes sense because part of me knew I had those chemicals in my body and, and I knew those chemicals was what's, what was in my muscles that needed to come out. 
because we were in Japan, it was so polluted over there. And then we moved and I get into rooms of cigarette smoke and I knew I had all that in my body. And I contributed back to there. But that's what happened. All the chemicals I was inhaling and everything. And now I'm getting it out of my body. My body's healing and I'm feeling a lot, lot better. My pain is down to a one and most of the time it's zero. Well, first, you know, every time you go to a new doctor, you're always nervous for the first time. <laughs> and I knew what I needed when I came here. And, and we went over my records and everything, and I was so com I was confident. I knew already he could help me. And I was confident that he could, but it, I was scared that he might not want me <laughs> since I had so much problems. <laughs> but um, yeah. He makes you feel like you're the only person in his office right at that time, and he doesn't rush with you. And that's what I like, because most chiropractors you go to, they rush you in and out like a bunch of cattle, and I do not like that. And I like somebody that listens to you and, and tests you and everything. And the muscle testing is very important because that tells you exactly what's going on in your body also and where your problems are. I say within a week, my body was back to like it was. The only, the only different thing that, that I noticed when I started here, that Dr. Salome wanted to start nutritional with me, nutrition. And I wasn't getting that anywhere else before. But I've seen it on TV, the, tre the treatments that he does in the office on TV before, and I always thought, that's what I would like to have, and he does exactly the, um, the uh, nutrition with the um, test in the body for the chemicals. There's, other, there's things wrong with my body that other people wouldn't have and that they may not have been exposed to like I was. And, and the two, they may not be as bad as I am. They just need a little bit of help, but I was in so bad shape and I didn't realize the, the um, nutritional part either that was important as much as the chiropractic also. My life was impacted with this so much because I had no life when I was in pain, no life whatsoever. I couldn't even drive to a grocery store without thinking, how long can I stay there before I can go back? Because I'd go to the grocery store and have to go home and go back to bed. I just, I cut myself off from everybody, even my husband, and I couldn't do anything. My husband was having to go to dinners and stuff with his position, and I couldn't even do that. I cut myself off from it. And now, I even amazed myself, because I just drove 11 hours one way, and I got there, and I was not in pain. And that tells me I am so much better, thank God, with, for him leading me to the right doctors and the right people to get this. And I know God led me back here because I knew, thank God, he was here. Go see Dr. Salome. I guarantee he will help you. And if you have faith and you believe and you have got to stay positive and get away from the negative, I had to cut everybody out of my life that was negative and because I am so negative and I've got to cut myself. <laughs> But you got to you just try, you know, what you got to lose, you're already in pain. You might as well come in here and try it because I truly believe he's a gift from God. God is working through your hands.